this is a sad one. I mean, man, if if you're going to have arguments or whatever, you know, somebody just leaves so you can just cool off. Um, these two young people right here, it's really sad. On the 17th, Saturday, around 6 o'clock in the morning, um, police were called because they got into a verbal argument. Then they turned around and got into a physical argument. This is Tanasia Bush, and he's Philip Hickman. He goes by K-9 Phil. From what I understand, they're both very talented. He, you know, he's rapping. He started rising to the top. Well, they got into an argument. She stabbed him in. She stabbed him in the arm, and he turned around. I guess quick reflex, and and he put a bullet in her. And that's it's really sad. They both went to the hospital. She succumbed to her injuries, but he didn't. He. He uh, was, was released for his wound to his arm. He talked to the investigators, told him exactly what had happened. And there were witnesses that saw the whole thing, too. And it was said that he was so distraught that he was just brokenhearted that uh, the family started searching for him and they couldn't find him. And when they did find him, they found him on the 18th Sunday and they found him in a school parking lot. And they said that when they approached, they approached the uh, young man, he unalived himself. They were a beautiful couple. And I know everybody has their issues and their relationships. But listen, when you're out here and you, you're having an argument or whatever, before it gets to that type of point, somebody just be the bigger person and leave. Just go cool off. Just leave. Apologize later on. You know what I'm saying? Because... It's not worth it. it. It is not worth it. Now we got two beautiful young people that are gone. Y'all pray for their families, um, man, their communities. They're you know looking at social media. They they were well well liked. Everybody loved them. Okay, so just pray for their families. You know, but it should not have to get to this point, y'all. And as always. Go over there and support the families, both families, you know, as a village, go over there and support them, pray for them, lift them up. You know, they're going to need they're going to need a village around them.